I'm always coughing. I'm tired of this. <coughs> hey, hi, hello. It is me, Sarah, again, and I just want to say welcome back to my videos. Today, I went ahead and am going to film a monthly favorites for the month of January. It's crazy to think we're almost in February. Like, February is tomorrow which is insane. Um, I have been trying out a bunch of stuff from December through January so let's go ahead and uh, get started talking about those. Um, I'm really excited to show you guys what I've been liking so far. I've been trying out like I said a lot of stuff um, because I got a lot of stuff for Christmas and all that fun stuff so let's go ahead and jump into it. Alright, the first thing that I've been liking is this uh, Kat Von D Shade Light Eye Palette. I've had this for a while, but um, I've been really l using it a lot lately. Um, I've just been really liking like this color and like the the like deeper shades. I don't know, I've just been really liking it. And this black color is like the blackest black ever. And it's wonderful just to put in your crease or like your outer V. And it is great. I also have a tutorial with just using this palette um, which I can link down below um, it was when I first got the palette so I've definitely experienced more with it um, so yeah I've definitely been liking this palette the shadows are super pigmented um, they're a little bit intimidating at first just because they are so pigmented but it's been really great and um, uh, yeah, you can create a lot of really awesome looks with this. I also like how all of them are matte as well, just because I'm more of a matte shadow girl than shimmer. But yeah, if you don't have this already, I definitely recommend picking it up. Definitely worth the money. Alright, next thing palette related that I've really been loving is this Too Faced Blush Wardrobe. Um, I've been really liking all of the colors in here. I've been playing around with all of them and so far I really like mixing this one which is called Your Love is King and I like mixing it with Baby Love and Love Hangover. I think that makes just a wonderful like flush to the cheeks and I'm wearing that today as well. Um, but I just love how it has all, the whole collection in here and you can try all of them without having to buy like the full size and you get a fairly decent uh, amount of like blush in here so I've really been liking this I'm really glad I picked it up if they still have it available which I'm not for sure you should definitely pick it up especially if you are interested in trying any Too Faced shadows I totally recommend it I've never used any Too Faced shadows before but after trying this I am in love and once I start running out of my favorite shades I'll most likely buy the full size. Alrighty, another palette which I've had for a while, which is the Oldie But A Goodie, but something that I have been using more lately now that I've been kind of doing blue eyebrows is this OMFG Chi Chi palette. I got this on my trip to Australia uh, because they are an Australian brand, but I love this palette. I use this, this color right here for my eyebrows mixed with... Um, like a Lorac cobalt blue at the ends and uh, I've been really liking this palette especially since I've been more into color lately I'm not exactly sure why but it's been working out really well and yeah and also the Chi Chi shadows are super beyond pigmented and I believe they're like $20 they're like a drugstore brand in Australia I'm fairly sure uh, but um, they are like insanely pigmented like look at that like that's insane like that's just one swipe on my finger like oh my god it's they're insane and the packaging is a little cheap feeling um, but the quality of the shadows is definitely spot on it's great they are wonderful I have six other Chi Chi palettes if y'all are interested in seeing a look with like any of the other Chi Chi palettes I have let me know down below just because I'd be happy to do that for you because I really love Chi Chi and unfortunately since I live in America I can't really get it that easily but I am in love with Chi Chi products like I, I love them they're great so if you live in Australia or New Zealand you should definitely pick this up or if you don't live in Australia or New Zealand and you still want to try their products they do have an online website and they do ship uh, 
I just made a dent in like this blue. But look how pigmented. Like, holy crap. Um, they do have... Okay. Let me just start that over because I'm a mess. Anyways, as I was saying, uh, they do have like a online store that you can buy and they do ship to America, but the shipping is like $20, so I suggest spending 100 so that way you get free shipping and all that fun stuff. So, um, yeah, Chi Chi products are a wonger. Alright, another lip duo that I've been really loving is this Kathleen Lights collaboration with Colourpop. It, they, it's been out for forever and a million days, but it's the Lumiere Lippy Pencil and the Lumiere uh, Lippy Liner Pencil thing. Um, it's just a wonderful, like, mauve color. I don't know how to explain it. Like, let me, let me see if I can swatch, but it's just a really pretty, like, mauve like, everyday, beautiful, like, pink color. I don't know. I've been wearing it a lot when I haven't been able to decide, like, what kind of like lipstick to wear and it's been definitely helping me out there so um, Lumiere is wonderful and I just found out they came out with a liquid lipstick version which if I you know ever get paid um, I will be picking up as well just because I love this color and I love Colourpop's liquid lipsticks so I'm definitely super excited about that but I've been using that a lot this month and I just thought I'd let you know. The next product that I got, I've been using it non-stop every single day since I bought it. And this is the Urban Decay Naked Skin Concealer. I use the color Fair Neutral and it works for under my eyes perfectly. This is what I use every single day. It's just phenomenal. The like it doesn't crease. The formula is really nice. I love the applicator. It's like a doe foot but it like has the perfect amount for like under the both eyes. I don't know how to explain it, but it is phenomenal and I just love this concealer. It's probably the best concealer I've ever tried and I know a lot of other people really like it as well and I can definitely see why there is a lot of hype. I love this concealer. It is the bomb. Another thing that I've been liking, obviously I've been liking all of these things. It's my monthly favorite. What is wrong with me? Um, is this MAC Maleficent, well it came out in the Maleficent collection, that's why it's in this packaging. Um, it's this sculpting powder and it's just in the color Sculpt. I've been using that for my contour, uh, ev like every day this month. I've had this for a while, obviously, that's why like the packaging's all messed up. But, um, I love this as like a contour shade, especially since I'm fair. It's really, really nice on fair skin tones and it's just... It's really great. When you try and swatch it though in the pan, like, it doesn't really show up. But when you put it on your face, it definitely shows up. It's just really finely milled, I guess. I don't know. But whenever I try to swatch it on my finger, I'm like, this is not pigmented. Like, this sucks. But when I put it on my face, it's phenomenal. And I bought a backup of it just because when I did purchase it, I didn't know if it was a, like, a permanent like shade um this is just in the maleficent packaging um it they it <clears throat> i cannot talk what is wrong with me um i believe it's like a pro item i guess but you can buy it online it's just the color sculpt and it's a sculpting pattern in the color sculpt so um definitely check this out i love this especially if you have fairer skin and it's wonderful so I got three more items to talk about today, and one of them is going to be this Ofra highlight in the color You Glow Girl. I believe it's a collaboration with the dupe, dupe that girls. I cannot talk. I cannot talk. Like seriously, this whole video is going to be me talking about how I can't talk. Um, and it's just the most awesome, beautiful, like highlight ever. I don't know. Can you? I don't know if you can even see that, but it is so pigmented. And one, it's huge. Look at it. It's like, it's huge. It's like as big as a pressed powder. It's, it's awesome. Um, and they always offer like coupons for Ofra and stuff. So it's definitely something you should get your hands off because, hands on, because it's a phenomenal highlight and I definitely recommend it. 
I want to pick up the other one, but I don't have any money right now, so that's going to have to wait. But once I do, definitely picking up the other one. But I've been using this, like, nonstop since I've gotten it, and I love it. To last, if I can hold it correctly, is this Makeup Forever HD High Definition. HD High Definition. This whole video, I'm so sorry. Um, it's just going to be this HD loose powder is what I meant to say. And this powder has been wonderful. I've been using it to bake with and also just like set my face. And I've been really liking it so far. The only complaint I have is when you open it, which I'm not going to open it right now because it's kind of full. Um, is the like, it kind of has like a mesh netting to, I guess to keep from like spilling everywhere. But it's kind of hard to get the product out just a little bit. And when I do, like, I feel like it goes everywhere. But when I do end up getting some on my face, I love it. Alright, and then last item that I want to talk about is going to be this Better Than Sex Mascara by Too Faced. And this is just the mini size because I haven't been around to, you know, get the full size yet. And this one hasn't been used up yet. So I love the brush, um, the formula is really good. I've been using it on my lashes a lot this month. Uh, I kind of go like through different mascaras every so often but lately I've been loving this one paired with my Mali volumizing mascara and it's been giving me the best lash days ever. Well guys I hope you enjoyed this monthly favorites. Sorry again for not being able to talk. Um, I don't know what else I want to say to you guys other than subscribe, become part of this little chicken nugget meal, and I love you guys so much. All my social medias will be linked down below as well as um, like all the products I mentioned in this video. Um, also, if you're interested in my nails, I made a whole video on that, which will be linked down below, and my website where I sell these Jamberry nails will be linked down below as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, please leave your video suggestions down below, as well as like any comments, concerns, questions, whines, gripes, all that fun stuff. Um, I love you guys so much. I don't know what else to say now. Um, I'm going to go get an oil change and hopefully go get some chicken nuggets. So um, I love you guys so much, and I think that's about it. So bye, guys. I hope you have a great evening, day, night. Whenever. Alright. Bye guys. Have a great night.